If you're looking for the best over-ear headphones, here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on their features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers, and customer feedback. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have Audio-Technica ATH-M50X. If you're looking to step up your audio game and want a pair of over-ear headphones that pretty much check all the boxes, then you'll want the Audio-Technica ATH-M50X at just $150. They're a fair deal for premium headphones, and you don't have to factor any extra accessories into the price since their low 38 ohm impedance will let you run them without the need for an extra amplifier. The ATH M50X headphones have a closed back design, so they'll isolate outside sound and let you focus on your audio. A pair of 45mm neodymium magnetic drivers power the audio experience and deliver a wide frequency response range. You'll get all the way down to 15Hz for more bass and up to 28kHz, ensuring you don't miss out on the high end in your tunes. These cans are ready for listening at home or on the go, as they fold up and come with multiple cable options, including a short one2 meter straight cable, if you prefer even more flexibility. Audio-Technica also offers a wireless version. Moving on to the next at number 2 with Tascam TH02. Over-ear headphones don't come much cheaper than this, but the Tascam TH02 comes from a reputable brand in the audio industry. With a TH02, you'll be getting a large 50mm driver in each ear for a full sound. The frequency response from 18Hz up to 22kHz means the headphones will be able to play back everything you'll want to hear. The close-back design can help you block out external sounds, so you just hear your music when you're on the go and the low impedance will let you easily power the drivers with a headphone jack on a laptop, tablet, or smartphone. The number 3 position is held by Sennheiser HD800S. Headphones can range in price from $15 to $1500, and if you have money to burn, the higher end of the spectrum gets you a real treat for your ears. While there are a few incredible sets of headphones on the high end, while there are a few incredible sets of headphones on the high end, Sennheiser's HD 800S are often seen as the high watermark on consumer audiophile cans. They have an insanely open soundstage, giving you some of the most natural sounding audio you'll ever hear, and adhere to a flat sound signature better than the vast majority of headphones out there. They aren't cheap, you'll need an amplifier to drive them, and many people probably won't even like the way they sound, but for true purists, it doesn't get much better. And hey, the price could be worse. Sennheiser makes a $60,000 set too. Next at number 4, we have Sony WH-1000XM4. Sony has once again pushed noise cancelling further. The new Sony WH-1000XM4 took what was already a great pair of headphones and made them just that little bit better. The new model connects to devices over Bluetooth 5.0 for a stronger, more stable connection but Sony leaves the door open for wired connections as well. You might not feel the need to use the wired connection often though, as these headphones offer a 30-hour battery life. And with support for the high-quality LDAC codec, they carry a fairly robust audio signal even over Bluetooth. With a close-back design and some of the active noise cancelling in the industry, you'll get to tune everything out and really dig into what you're listening to. When you do need to hear the outside world, you won't even have to take off the headphones. Just put a hand over your one ear cup and the Sony WH-1000XM4 microphones will temporarily disable the noise cancelling feature so you can hear the world around you. The number 5 position is held by Plantronics Backbeat Pro 2. Most of the headphones on this list are wired because when it comes to straight up audio quality, you get more for your money with a wired headphone since it's cheaper to manufacture than wireless. But if you're diving headfirst into this brave new headphone jackless world, there are some great wireless options out there too. The Plantronics Backbeat Pro 2 are a great choice for under $150, with a bit extra bass and convenient on-ear controls, and without a bunch of extra features that inflate the price. They do have active noise cancelling though, 
And while it isn't quite on the level of the Sony WH-1000XM4 mentioned above, if noise cancelling is your prime concern and you have the money, Sony's offering a good step up. But if you just want a pair of wireless cans that offers great value for your money, Plantronics has you covered. The number 6 position is dominated by Wise Headphones. There is no shortage of cheap, wireless over-ear headphones you can pick up on the market right now. But if you want premium features at the budget price point, you're going to want the Wise Headphones. For just $50, you're getting a pair of Bluetooth headphones that include active noise cancellation. That feature alone sets them apart from the competition in their price ballpark, but they go even further. The Wise headphones use Bluetooth 5.0 and can connect with two devices at once, letting you easily switch between audio sources. You can also use them as wired headphones with a 3.5mm audio cable, which also lets you tap into their extended frequency response range. The mics used for noise cancelling serve a second purpose, as the headphones can let ambient sound in with quick conversation mode. In case you need to hear what someone is saying, but don't want to constantly be taking your headphones off. Roughly 20 hours of battery life and quick charging over USB-C ensure the standout capabilities of these headphones hold up through the day. Moving on to the next, at number 7 with Hi-Fi Man HE400i. All the headphones on this list thus far use dynamic drivers. A small coil receives a signal from your computer, phone, or other device, which creates a magnetic field that reacts with a magnet to vibrate a diaphragm and create sound. Planar magnetic headphones use a different driver design, with magnets on either side of a thin, flat diaphragm. Without getting insanely technical, this allows for more natural bass extension and less harmonic distortion. However, these types of drivers are more expensive to produce, so there's less variety than there is in dynamic driver-based headphones. And planar magnetic cans tend to be a bit bigger and heavier. Planars are becoming more popular though, with the $190 Hi-Fi HE400i a common entry point, it's one of those things you kind of have to hear to understand. So if you just haven't found a pair of headphones that fits your taste, give some planar magnetics a listen. You might become a convert. The number 8 position is held by Microsoft Surface Headphones 2. For a bit of extra smarts, the Microsoft Surface Headphones 2 have some tricks in store. These over-ear headphones provide battery life for wireless listening even on the longest workdays with 18.5 hours for audio playback or 15 hours for voice calls. You can also enjoy enhanced wireless audio thanks to support for aptx codec. If you're running low on battery, you can also switch to a 3.5mm audio connection or you can charge back up to 100% in under 2 hours. The Surface Headphones 2 aim to make your life a bit easier. You'll find you can easily control the volume of what you're listening to with a dial on the right ear and control the volume of the world around you with a dial on the left ear, which provides 13 levels of active noise cancellation. The dual microphones that handle your voice calls can also let you address your choice of voice assistant. Where they get really smart is in Microsoft 365. You'll be able to use the headphones for dictation in Microsoft's productivity suite letting you rest your hands and get a little more comfortable in your office chair from time to time. Next at number 9, we have Apple AirPods Max. Apple just got in on the hi-fi game with the release of the new premium AirPods Max. These over-ear headphones offer Apple's custom-made dynamic drivers in large. The headphones are about as Apple as a device can get, aesthetically, with a smooth metal exterior and even Apple's digital crown for adjusting volume controlling audio playback, taking calls, and bringing up Siri. These are rather heavy headphones, but Apple has designed a mesh band on the top that should distribute the weight evenly. The AirPods Max come at a higher price, but you'll be getting active noise cancellation through 8 microphones as well as a transparency mode to allow you to keep enjoying your tunes while still being able to hear the outside world. You'll also get spatial audio with Apple's head tracking feature on supported iPhones and iPads. The head tracking is powered by an Apple H1 chip in each ear cup. The AirPods Max connect wirelessly over Bluetooth 5.0 and have a 20-hour battery life, though you can also use a wired connection with a 3.5mm to lightning cable. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Razer Opus. The Razer Opus headset 
will check a lot of boxes for headphone shoppers, and support for true THX sound is one of them. The headset was built to THX specifications, and it delivers on frequency response, minimal distortion, and noise isolation. It goes even further to cut down on external sound with active noise cancellation. Of course, when a headset does this much to erase your surroundings, you can easily toggle on and off ambient sound mode to hear what's around you. You'll find plenty of memory foam cushioning inside the Razer Opus, so you can stay comfortable even if you want to hear it for a long time to truly test the 24-hour battery life. When it comes time to charge the battery backup, you can do so with the modern USB-C cable. And for connectivity, you can enjoy the best of both worlds with both Bluetooth and wired audio. That's all for today. We upload product review videos every single day. So don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.